In the annals of biblical history, a profound pivot occurs with the Mosaic Covenant. This defining moment marks a significant turning point, a critical juncture that etches itself deep into the timeline of history. Born on the rugged slopes of Mount Sinai, amid the thunderous roars of divinity, this covenant was far from being a mere rulebook for the Israelites. It was not just a set of instructions or a list of do's and don'ts. Rather, it was the very blueprint of a relationship between God and His chosen people, the Israelites. Its birth took place under circumstances of great significance. Amid the roar of thunder and the spectacular display of divine fire, the Mosaic Covenant was born. It held an essence that not only divine, but also deeply personal. An intricate, complex, and profound roadmap to the divine, it was here that a relationship between the Creator and His people was forged in a manner that had never been seen before. This was not merely a transactional relationship, but a deeply personal and intimate covenant. At the heart of this covenant, we find the Ten Commandments. These were not just a mere set of moral guidelines, but the divine foundation that formed the backbone of this covenant. They governed every aspect of life for the Israelites, from worship of God, social order, and even ceremonial practices. The Ten Commandments, though seemingly simple, held a depth of meaning and application that would govern every aspect of Israelite life. However, the Mosaic Covenant wasn't limited to these ten. It branched out, like the roots of a mighty tree, into a diverse array of laws. It set down everything from dietary norms to justice guidelines, from sacred rituals to civil laws. It touched upon every aspect of living, from what one ate, how one dressed, to how one interacted with others. It was a complete and comprehensive guide to life, a divine constitution if you will. This unique set of customs and ethical standards set the Israelites apart from other nations. It established them not merely as a group of people but as a unique, chosen nation, a people apart for God, living under His divine laws and guidance. This uniqueness was not only in their customs and practices but also in the very fabric of their social and spiritual life. In this covenant, obedience to God's laws brought blessings. However, disobedience invoked curses. This was a stark reminder of the gravity of their commitment to God and His commitment to them. It emphasized a mutual relationship of fidelity and protection. A covenant not based on fear but on mutual respect, love, and devotion. A relationship that mirrored the divine love of God for His people and their reciprocating love and obedience to Him. The ripple effects of the Mosaic Covenant stretch far beyond its time and location. It shapes societal structures, personal behaviors, and deeply influences Judeo-Christian ethics, even today. Its influence can be seen in the laws, the cultures, the belief systems, and the moral codes that govern our world today. From the concept of justice to the sanctity of life, from the ideals of love and kindness to the importance of truth and integrity, the Mosaic Covenant's impact can be felt in every sphere of life. The Mosaic Covenant was never just about laws and regulations, it was the framework for a community under God, a society governed divine justice and mercy, aimed at bringing the best out of its people. It was the blueprint for a theocratic society where God was the supreme ruler, the lawgiver, the judge, and the provider. It was not merely a social contract, but a sacred covenant, a divine relationship that transcended the barriers of time and space, a relationship where the divine and the human intertwined, where heaven touched earth, a relationship that continues to inspire, guide, and transform millions, even today. The Mosaic Covenant was never just about laws and regulations, it was the framework for a community under God, a society governed by divine justice and mercy, aimed at bringing the best out of its people.